Alright guys, so we are just heading out right now with our massive 45 foot header and we're going to be starting our next field of wheat. I think that last field that we just did in the last video, that, that turned out pretty good and we made a lot of good straw bales and they're actually going for some pretty good money right now down at the animal dealer and so I'm just thinking we're going to take all of the straw bales that we make down there to make some money. And uh, I, I hope this field um, yields just as good as the first one did. But fingers crossed. <laughs> oh, it's not the corn here. We, we didn't. Our corn is coming up pretty good. It's coming up pretty tall and everything. <laughs> I didn't even have to spray herbicide this season. All right, let's park here, and let's go back to the farm and get the combine. And if you guys haven't done so yet, please make sure to like and subscribe to Will Slack so you won't miss out on any more videos like this and uh, other roleplay videos and shorts. So, uh, this field, it's kind of big. Well, yeah, probably our biggest wheat field that we have. So, um, I'm just hoping that we're going to get some good yield well i mean with how big the field is i'm pretty sure we're gonna get some good yield man this thing flies down the road well it doesn't so anyway our sugar beets and soybeans they are um coming up pretty good and uh our corn is too and i'm thinking we're probably gonna have a big crop this fall and prices are actually um starting to go up slowly for corn and soybeans so I'm thinking that harvest will be good this fall. Alright guys, so we have everything fired up, and we are just eating wheat right now. And all of our systems are good, like the thresher, the separator, and the cleaner, and the, the draper belts. They're working pretty good. No issues right now, and going good. We're just slowly going up but not too slow just slow enough to get a good yield I, I did really take care of this wheat and um last season this was sugar beets here and it was pretty good yeah oh that's a pretty nice view there I should have made that the thumbnail instead maybe I can so anyway in a couple seconds I'm gonna go and get the truck so I'll see you guys Okay, so I just hired an AI worker, and they're going to be harvesting the wheat while we go. Okay, jump the ditch. Okay, run across the road, and run through the sugar beets. <laughs> oh, man. i got to stop running, because... And big jump! Oh, okay. <sighs> All right. Truck's fired up. Whew. That's the longest jump I've made in a while. <laughs> Alright, so this first trailer, it's almost completely loaded, but we're at like 82, 83%. I oh, don't know. And no cars come in. Nope, we're good. Oh, whoa, wow. Okay, I did not see that car. I'm so sorry, sir. Or ma'am, whatever. I didn't quite pay attention to that. <laughs> Alright, this thing is kind of slow, but we'll get there. It's got a pretty good engine in it. It's just one thing about these trailers, though. You need a lot of horsepower. All right, guys. So the AI is full, and we're just unloading them right now. And uh, it's actually some pretty nice dry wheat. No, it's not dirty or wet or anything. It's just dry. Woo! That blew a lot of smoke. <laughs> it's kind of funny of how much, like, okay, so like. When it's just idle, like right now, well, it was, there's like no smoke coming out of it. But once you step on the gas, a lot of smoke comes out. <laughs> I'm like, what? How does that even make any sense? Nah, it's just, it's just a game. Okay, it's been a couple minutes. Well, actually more than that, but it's just a figure of speech. So, it's been a couple minutes and I got... The grain cart down here, the 8RX 410, four track model. And I uh, just got the semi parked on the, the dirt road. And I'm just making a headland right now. So, okay. Oh, 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 stop. 
don't want to hit the telephone pole, and I also don't want to go on their property. These people are really nice. Uh, they made a good offer when I bought um, this field, because this was actually their field. I think these people are the Cunnings, C-U-N-N-I-N-G-S. They're the made-up people. I, I'm pretty sure you guys knew that um, this is all fake. It's just a game, so I'm just making up things to make it realistic. That's how some people do it. So these people, they're the Cunnings, and they're actually pretty nice people. They've lived here for probably 25 years, and they actually used to farm a little bit of land. Uh, but then uh, the government did something, I don't know what, and then they lost their field, so I bought it for them. You know, I thought they'd give me a higher offer, but I think um, they, like, I, I, I can't remember, but they gave me an offer for this field for, like, about, oh, I can't remember. It's been a long time. I, I may have to ask them, maybe they'll remember. I bet they still have the paperwork. Okay, we're on the other side of the field, and we're full, so I'm just going there to unload. But I, I'm kind of like a bad combine driver because, well, I am full, and the auger is in the wheat, but it should be on the outside of the wheat. Anyway, here's the wheat, um just coming up now it's like starting to rise up in the, in the green cart it kind of reminds me of rise up country I don't know it's just, it's just something on the radio I once heard okay so I've been running the combine again and we're full so let's jump out and get in <laughs> get in the 8RX 410 and let's go unload this tractor I've I've had this probably for the longest. Oh, nope. No, I haven't. It was the 4755. That's the one that I've had the longest. No, I actually, nope. It's the 4000 diesel, I think. That one's the longest. <laughs> no, I haven't. Because on the game, I've had it for one year. Not in real life, but um, in the game, one year. Okay, so the lead trailer is topped off, and now let's start unloading in the pup. There we go. Full blast. 410 horse going into that into that grain cart. It's pretty cool. I think maybe I should get a bigger tractor. Or actually, I think I should get a new combine. But the reason I have an SX-70 and won't buy a new combine, it's because in real life, my grandpa has an SX-70. So that's why I want to use that one and not get like an X-9 or something. Because I have the money to get one, but I just don't want to. Check in the percentage in the truck right now, and it's pretty good. We're like 70 something percent, I think that's what it said. I don't know, but anyway, uh, let's, let's get back to harvesting some wheat and so I can bail it so I can make some money. So I'm thinking of just hauling the wheat down to the, uh, the train elevator, but oh, I want to show the yield. So let's go on the iPad here and let's go. Nope, nope, we gotta go to precision farming. There. Okay, switch over to yield. And this is um, our yield right now. So that's about 85, 90%. And um, uh, let's see, this stuff right here, that was from last season. And that was the sugar beets. They yield pretty good. Okay, so I've just been harvesting until I got to the poles. And that's what I wanted to do. And so now we're gonna be stopping harvest. And I'm going to be um, doing some bailing off camera. And I actually heard that the Saginaw County Fair will be in town in August. And so I just want to get this wheat done. So that way by the time August comes around, we can go to the fairgrounds. Alright, I'm just going to load the rest into this trailer here. And there we go, 410 horsepower going into it again. That was about 45%. I don't know. Um, I think it was. I Sometimes I don't really pay attention to that when I'm unloading. I just really pay attention to how full the trailer gets. So. <laughs> uh, Alright. We're done. And now this video will be in a second too. <laughs> so. Um, I'm actually going to check now. 
Ah, dang it. Okay, so we're at a good amount. Maybe 80 something. Alright, and there's the prices. Ah, they're not up until January. I uh, figured. Well, anyway, uh, it's going to be the end of today's video. And uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And hey, I'll see you guys in the next one when we're going to be finishing up this field and starting field 11. See you guys.